ever been this prepared. Because we prepared very well. Uh, the teams, uh, the teams you see, which are going, are, are champions from uh, fresh dairy games and also from board games to and athletics and also from swimming. And after that, we prepared them. The athletes, uh, for example, those of athletics have been in the camp. Those of swimming have also been uh, in the camp, sort of, training hard. And all the schools that are going were in the camp at their schools. So they have never been prepared, this prepared. And we think that uh, Uganda should be able to compete very well. But we also know that other countries have also prepared so well. So it will be a real competition, but we hope for the best for Uganda. We know all along our schools have been struggling with the funds and financial conflicts. Has this time around government come up to help the schools? In, in Uganda, what we normally do in order to send a very big contingent like the one you see now, we do what we call cost sharing. Government has done its part and the schools have also done their part. And that's why Team Uganda is so strong. Your message on this spring? Uh, on this spring, we have never had a big challenge about this spring, apart from the normal competition between the different schools from the same country when they reach the other side. But this time around, we have briefed the teams, we have put rules and regulations in place, and we are very sure that uh, our teams will definitely help us.